the Georgia Department of Labor Miners in Entertainment Miner Certification Site. Before an employer can hire a miner within the state of Georgia, the employer needs to be registered and certified with the Georgia Department of Labor. And before a miner can be employed, they must be registered and certified with the Georgia Department of Labor. This video will demonstrate how to register a miner and obtain the miner's certification to work in entertainment in Georgia. On the Georgia Department of Labor website, select the Individuals tab at the top of the page. Under the section titled Specialized Services, you will see Youth. And on this page, Youth Specialized Services, you will see Minors in Entertainment. So click on Minors in Entertainment. Then scroll down to the heading Minor Certification Requirements. And under that heading, select Minor Registration and Login. This is the Minor Representative Sign-On page. Before you can log in, you will need to register and get an account with the Georgia Department of Labor. Select Register Here and you will land on the Minor Registration page. Provide the required information on the minor whom you are registering with the system. Remember when entering this field, enter the representative's email. The rules and regulations concerning child labor can be found at this site. You will need to read these rules and acknowledge that you have read and understand them. Click on this box to acknowledge and then sign this page in this field. You can choose to add more minors before you proceed. You can add up to five minors. If not, then select Continue. Now the minor is registered with the Georgia Department of Labor. This is your confirmation number. You can print this page or click on Exit and you would be back at the home page. The representative will receive an email confirming the registration. This initial email will contain your user ID, also referred to as your username, which you will use with your password when you log into the system. The email also notifies you that your notification of approval or disapproval will be emailed to you within five business days. Once the Georgia Department of Labor approves your application, you will receive the second email confirming your account and providing you with a temporary password. Click on this link to reset your password. Enter the user ID, which was provided to you on the initial email from the Georgia Department of Labor. Then paste the temporary password or key it in. And then enter your new password, which is your permanent password. When creating your new password, remember these requirements. The password must be 8 to 20 characters and must contain at least one letter and one number. This field is case sensitive and your password cannot be the same as your username. Then click on Create Password. Then select Security Questions in order to retrieve your account password if needed. And then select Register. Now the password has been reset and you can sign on using your updated credentials. Select Sign On. Enter your username, which is your user ID, and your new password. Now you can log into the system, and this is the landing page. The Georgia Department of Labor provides numerous links on this page to assist the miners' representative. If you have any questions, then select the Inquiries link located here. The Georgia Department of Labor responses can be accessed through the same inquiries link. And here is the response provided by the department. Let us know if we can help in any way. And thank you for using the Georgia Department of Labor's Miners in Entertainment System.